Like, does that even look like big money to you? Oh my goodness. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, this is gonna be a category Bolo video where I pick a category and talk about it. Now, this is gonna be more of a category slash specific big money Bolo. And we're gonna talk about maybe the best platform to sell it on because it seems like more sell on what platform one platform than others and for more money. So this was some exciting research that I just did. So the item that we're talking about in this video is, I don't know, would you guys call this costume or designer or fashion? What is J Crew to you guys? Me, I love J Crew and I sell a lot of J Crew. I find them in my untanglings a lot and you guys always pick them up for a good price. And I'm learning that some of them can go for crazy money. So I'm just going to show you the ones that sold for $65 and up. And this isn't everything. This is what eBay goes back, what, 90 days? But you're going to see some crazy sold prices. And there is one necklace, one necklace that goes for absolutely crazy money. And I'm going to show it to you. So you definitely, if you find it, oh, you are going to make some money. <laughs> are you ready? All right. So we are not going to confirm or uh, figure out if all of these sold, but I am going to show you another one. And I can show you that it sold and for a crazy price. But let's just look at some of these beauties. I'm pretty sure I sold one very similar to this um, on my Whatnot show. And if you guys are not following me on Whatnot, what I do is I dump bags of jewelry and I do untanglings and I just pull items up and I sell them. And everything starts at $5 or less on my Whatnot. So I do have a lot of resellers buying from me and flipping. Um, many of you have already come over. I appreciate that greatly. Thank you so much. I hope more of you will come in and join the show. Just come check it out. See if it's a good fit for you. It may or it may not be. Um, if you don't sell jewelry, then it's probably not a good fit. But I do sell other things over there as well. But there is a referral affiliate link down below. You can get $15 to shop with that if you join Whatnot with it. So check that out down below. If you're thinking about branching out and selling on a new platform, I also have tutorials on how to sell on whatnot, just type in Bolo Buddies, how to sell, or I'm sorry, Bolo Buddies, whatnot for beginners. And there's videos. I think I have them linked in the description as well. There's a referral seller link as well. It will let whatnot know that I sent you and um, it may get you accepted quicker. I'm not sure. So you can check that out, but let's just look at some of these prices. All right. But I'm going to give you a keyword to use for some of the bigger money ones. But what I want to talk to you about is how do we know when to use that keyword? So let's talk about that as we move up. But right now we're just kind of scrolling through. We're looking at some of the sale prices. You're seeing some really, really beautiful J. Crew items. I mean, J. Crew is just rad. I found a cuff bracelet in my uh, show the other night, but it was missing a, a rhinestone or two. But man, it was so cool. I didn't even know they made bracelets. I sold one uh, no, that was a Stella and Dot, but I sold something similar to this the other night. It was a Stella and Dot. It was really beautiful. But you can just kind of see here, uh, J. Crew is usually very rhinestone-y and big and bold and in your face, and you'll recognize it if you see it. Uh, it usually has the little ship, like ship thing, wheel or float device. Is it a flotation device? You guys know what I'm talking about? Look that up. Get familiar with it because sometimes the J. Crew tag does fall off. So we're up in the $70 range right now. But just wait, guys. Wait until you see what some of these necklaces sold for. They are gorgeous. Oh, look at that one. Just, just gorgeous. And not all J. Crew is created equal. So you definitely want to do your homework. I am searching high to low. You can also do a search from low to high and just see, did anybody make a mistake? Now this says flawed, all right? So I don't know what that means, but it's still sold for decent money. You can still sell things missing rhinestones, missing parts, missing pieces. Somebody could take this apart and make something else with it. So don't be afraid to list things that have damage. Just disclose it. All right, we're going to keep going here and we're going to get to this big money, huge bolo, unbelievable. 
Unbelievable. I mean, it's just shocking. All right, I'm going to keep scrolling just to give you an idea of what some of the J. Crews look like and the prices um, that they're going for. If they are slashed through, that means the buyer took an offer. So you would have to go over to Terapeak and copy and paste into the uh, search on Terapeak to see what the actual sold price was. That's how you do that. You know what? I think I sold this one also because I remember somebody said they look like bugs. It may have been similar to this. Maybe not exactly. It may have only had some in the front. It's, uh, I can't remember. But this one is new with tags. And of course, new with tags is going to increase the price that you're going to get for your item more than likely. Very, very cool. Okay, we're getting up here, guys. We're getting closer. I'm so excited to show this to you. Oh, my goodness. It's, it's getting there. All right. Oh, look how pretty that is. That is awesome. So J crew, be on the lookout and look it up. Don't like do your research guys, do your homework. But if you see this one that I'm going to show you, oh my goodness. And I'm going to show you where it's sold more than once for big money. It's not like a fluky thing. I don't want to give you guys bad information. I want to prove it. So we're going to get to that in a second. All right. I didn't realize I had so many to show you. But look how beautiful they are. I love J. Crew. So um, it's such a good quality brand, in my opinion. Okay. So we're getting higher here. $129.99 on that one. Look at this one. Woo Usually J. Crew gets the woo <laughs> Love it. All right. We're getting fancier. Prices are going up. Look at these guys. 195. 279 crossed out. Brulee. 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 So I looked up the definition of this word and it has something to do with food. So I'm not sure why this necklace is called that. If anybody knows, let me know. But this is the key word that you're looking for. B-R-U-L-E-E. -E. And it seems to be like it's something with something around it encased, like it's encased. See how this is encased? Because look at this. Uh, this one has it also. And maybe it's, uh, they've got these little marks. Maybe it's, a, I, I don't know. But look at this one, 550 crossed out. So I don't know what it sold for. This one, 575, but it's crossed out. But this one sold for 650 and it's crossed out. So that means it did not sell for it. But pay attention here. You see, this is green. See, it's green. This one is not, but that's a different style. Now, look, ready? Here it is. I'm going to show you close-ups. And this one doesn't have the, uh, what is it called? Like the floaty device. It's a different one. And it's like a lime green. There's your marking, J. Crew. That's pretty standard, but again, sometimes that falls off. So look for the other identifiable uh, factors. This is what the back of the necklace looks like. Does that even look like big money to you? Oh my goodness. I probably would have had no idea. So Tara Peak says that this sold for 400 on eBay. So wait, wait until you see what I'm going to show you next, okay? Feedback says... And sometimes the feedback will change to the actual sold price here. And sometimes it doesn't. So you can just use Terapeak if it does not. But you can see that they got positive feedback. So it was a good sale. Terapeak, you go over to the research tab. So right here, you go to research, you click on product research, and then you copy and paste, hit search. I'm under the last three years and right there. And I typed it in, um, I copied and pasted, so it only pulled up the one. Now, there's your feedback. Let's go over to um, Poshmark, okay? So let's let's scroll down a little more. Let's just scroll down to some of these J. Crew. I'm gonna say maybe get your J. Crew on Poshmark if you sell J. Crew. And I do have a referral link down below. If you join Poshmark with that, you'll get $10 to shop. And I also have Mercari. You'll get $10 to shop when you join with that and another $20 when you sell $100 worth of items on Mercari. 
So both those referral links are down there, but you can see the keyword brulee or brulee on all of these. And you see how it's like this rhinestone encased in this. That's kind of what I'm seeing for that word. So I'm guessing maybe that's the definition, but these are hot sellers. Look at all of them on Poshmark. Poshmark is where it's at. Now, Poshmark goes back further. I can see more solds on Poshmark than I can eBay. eBay is only going back, what, 90 days? But look at all these, 300, 300. And you can see there's different ones that do not say that keyword as well. But I'm going to take you to the top and I'm going to show you what that same necklace that sold on eBay for 400 for sold for on Poshmark. But I just want to give you some more ideas of some of these that have sold. And I feel like maybe, just maybe, I have uh, sold some of these <laughs> on my whatnot show. It would not, it would not surprise me. Now this one only went for 239. That's, that's the necklace, but um, I'm not sure when that one sold, but I'm going to go to the top and you guys, that's why you got to research. You got to research all platforms and you got to you got to do your research cuz eBay it may sell for 400 on eBay but it sells for more on Poshmark. This one $200 they underpriced it. All right, let's go to the top. All the way to the top and check this out you guys. Check this out and we missed some of the other ones that I'm going to show you. So this is this is a fakey. This is a not for sale. I don't know why people um, do this. I don't know if it's to draw people into their store. I don't know if it's sold on another platform. I'm not 100% sure. Sometimes they'll do that if it sells on another platform. They just mark it as sold, I think. And that's why it says sold out. Or I, I don't know. I'm not sure. If anybody knows, I'm not like, I don't know everything about Poshmark. So I do sell on the platform. But to get it to say sold out, I'm not really sure. Maybe they had duplicates or multiples. But it says not for sale. So if anybody knows, let me know. 700, guys. 700. Oh, they have a video. 675. 575. So remember that that same necklace sold on eBay for 400. So where are you going to sell it? Probably Poshmark, right? Probably Poshmark. Um, 550. This is iridescent. Here's one, $4.99. That has the original tag. I wonder, let's see if it tells us the retail price. That is what I want to know. Does it tell us how much it retails for? Mm, it, well, they didn't show us if it does. So Mercari, let's look at Mercari. And I just filtered high to low and I put in J. Crew necklace, high to low. Uh, Mercari is a little bit harder to research certain items. I do see this one that went for 140, 141 on this one. Look at this one. This one doesn't even have any bling and it went for 150. So definitely do your research on J. Crew. It is a uh, really, it can be a high dollar brand. Now look, $86. Somebody probably bought that and flipped it on uh, Poshmark. <laughs> you never know. All right, you guys, what do you think? Where are you going to put your J Crew? Uh, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And thanks for watching.